Shadow Womb. I'm going to tell y'all, Cat Williams telling everything. This man is telling everything. I'm going to tell you what he just, I just put a video down. Listen, y'all might not understand what he's saying, but he's saying the person, he's, this what he said. So this what caught my attention. He said, if YT people don't like black people, why are you always watching us? That caught my attention right there. He said, they wrote, he said, the person that wrote the lie, um, to get you to go somewhere else to look for something else. And then you need to, when the answer is somewhere else. Now, I'm going to tell you what I just found out today. That if you a Mason, that you will, if you black, you will never become the high Mason. He snitched on that too. He said the high Mason has a pass. It's like the highest, highest Mason. They got a pass where they can go see the body of Christ. Now, I'm going to tell y'all something, which is a black man. <sighs> Listen, y'all. I don't want to bust nobody bubbles, but I'm going to tell y'all what. One thing about what I'm saying. I asked the Most High to show me the truth. And I'm going to tell y'all something. It ain't what you used to. It ain't. You need to ask the Most High to show you and tell you. I've always said this, and I'm not lying. Y'all know that, that I think the Bible is scripted. I, because if they know that they're coming to an end, why are they not scared? What are they trying to say or what they're trying to do? Listen, something ain't right. And I keep telling folks, something ain't right. I pray and I, let me tell y'all something. This whole, I have been in the house for two weeks. The most high said, don't go out unless you got to. So I, for two weeks straight, I goes downstairs today. And next thing I know, I done found out everybody in the building was sick but me. I'm going to say it for the people in the back. Everybody in the sick in the building was sick but me. I, the reason I didn't, wasn't sick because I was obedient. So my thing is this. God had dropped some things in my spirit. About a lot of stuff that in that Bible that I know that ain't right. The person that don't want you to find out the truth is not going to give you the truth. This is what they scared of. Everything coming out. Why is all our information? Listen, I don't know about no 12 tribes. I swear I do not. But I will tell you this much. Everybody now is claiming to be a Jew. I'm going to say it again. Everybody claiming to be a Jew. Everybody. Um, when only the people in the United States fit the description to a T. So how was it 12 tribes? Now I'm going to tell y'all, y'all got to be very understanding. Your adversary is very cunning and it's very few people. And I mean very few people that can figure it out and understand it. And that's why a lot of people not going to make it because they're not going to want to accept the truth. I accept what he tells me. I accept it because I understand I ask for it. People don't want to ask for the truth because it's scary. They got you in such a box. They got you um they got you in a shoe box. I don't live like that. No. I don't live like that. Once I was awakened, that's it. I understand some things. And that Bible may be true. But I'm gonna tell you what Cat Williams said. You looking for something. Somewhere else. But what you're looking for is already in our community. Mm. Mm. Let me tell y'all something. They keep talking about Christ. First of all, let me explain. Y'all know when I when I talk about the most high, how I what go on with me. I was praying. 
And one day, and the Most High said this to me right in my ear. He said, "What did those? He asked, tells me what what he says in the Bible. He said, "Don't I say, don't have no other God before me?" So wait a minute. I said, "Yes." I started praying just to Him because my thing is this: I don't want to be out of bounds. I don't want to be out of bounds with Him. And, but people tell us that you need to go through Yeshua. But the Old Testament said, and I'm going to keep it wise with you. The Old Testament, and then the Bible said, never have another God before me. So how is, you have to go through Yeshua to get to him. That doesn't make any sense to me. If he sent someone here, because I'm, from what I understand, people is like, all this stuff is coming out. If he did come, he was not God. Why do we need, I, why do I need somebody to come to me? I need to go through to get to my God. He said, don't, this was his exact words when I was, he said, did not say there was not to have another God before me. And I said, that's when I stopped saying, you know, but the world is fixated on putting Christ or Yeshua in front of him. But we don't know if the writings that they've given us are 100% true. The Most High in the Gospel of Thomas, he said they'll never tell you the truth. And I'm telling, I think about that almost every day. Almost every, and he said they will never tell you. You have to understand, it is clues in that Bible. That let you know if you're doing right or wrong. Are we being bullheaded because we think that everything is right? That's in that Bible. That Bible been shredded a million times. Do y'all hear me shredded? A million times. I can remember stuff that was in that Bible when I was a child. And it ain't in there no more. You know what? I'm going to just do what the most high tell me. That's it. But I know he said that in my ear. He said, don't have no other God before me. So how were they putting a false God? They called him Jesus. He never said, Yeshua never said that he was God. He never said that. He said, if you see me, you see my father. But this is the problem. That people don't understand it. When he said that, he said, it, they walk in the same shoes they are alike. He never said he was on the he was on a uh, tree, uh, really passing away. And he said he asked his father to save him. So how why would you ask yourself to save yourself? That don't make no sense. When he could have stopped it, if he could have stopped it, he would have. But he knew what it was. Something ain't right. Something ain't right. And it's going to be very few people that figure this out. It's going to be too late. Do y'all understand? Stop following people and just follow the most high. Something ain't right about that Bible. And I'm scared for my people because something ain't right. They got people saying that they in the 12 tribes. How do we know it's 12 tribes? Because this the thing, nobody in the whole entire world match us. No one. No one. Unless all the 12 tribes are in the United States, there is not another person on the planet that can match us. I don't care what ethnicity, what race, where they came from. We are untouchable. And I am not trying to be uh, boastful. I'm not trying to be nothing. It is what it is. I want y'all to be very careful because I'm going to tell y'all, this time is winding down. And if you don't figure out the truth, when the door is shut, it's going to be too late. Don't have another God before him. Don't. Don't. Once you figure that out, then the truth and everything will start coming to you. But I love y'all. I don't know how y'all going to take it, but I love y'all.